Ladies and gentlemen, it is about that time. It is with great pleasure that I have the privilege of informing you. Demon Slayer Season 4 Trailer Day. Super excited to jump into this and see what this promotional reel has in store for us. I'm very excited for the upcoming arc and to see where we go from here as we continue on with Tanjiro's journey. So I've spoken enough. Without any further ado, let's jump right in. Two, one, go. I'm here, bro. Let's go. You foldable. You guys already know that you at the beginning stands for unlimited budget. <laughs> oh, man, I'm here. Music is so good. I got chills already. Man, we've come so far. Genya with that America breathing. You love to see it. 2019 season one, 2020, 2021, Muga. Man, they milked the hell out of Muga Train, did they? Lasted two years. <laughs> Entertainment, Drew Stick Dark, and then Swordsmith Village. Let's go. Show me the new stuff. Man, this moment was so amazing. Morning. Bro, Nezuko has conquered the sun, bro. All right, 2024. Oh, a new scroll. Wow, it has all the Hashiras. Nichirin Blade Guards. All right, there they are. Muichiro, Gyome, Sanami, and Gyome are the ones I want to see fight the most. Obanai too. Mitsuri at the end there? Okay. A new chapter begins. Woo! Let's go. I'm here. Hashira training arc. Yo, Tengen, my boy! He's got an eye patch now. He looks so badass. What? Yo. Giyu, all right. Nezuko has conquered the sun, ladies and gentlemen. Muzan is coming after her now with the aggression. What's up, Tanjiro? Episode one, one hour special. Okay, so just like they did with um season three, episode one. Season premiere. Spring 2024, okay. So March, April, June, around there? Possibly? Love to see it. Are they doing another world tour? It's got to be another world tour, right? I figured. Okay. Can y'all come to Kenya? I'd love that. Special screening. Okay. I see. Oh man, this episode was so awesome. So I'm assuming just like the way they did with um, the season 3 premiere, they're gonna show... Tanjiro going after Antengu so badass. So they're just gonna do the exact same thing they did with season 3. Showing the last episode of season 2 and the first episode of season 3. Music is haunting, bro. What? I'm, I'm here, bro. To the Hashira training. Expanded world screenings, okay. 1,800 screens. Wow, more screenings worldwide. Will you be coming to Kenya? Does that include Kenya too? Probably not, but anyway. No worries, man. To any of you guys who were able to go see it in theaters, I hope you all enjoy. World Tour 24, key visual? Ooh, bro! <gasps> nah, Tengen with the eye patch. He looks so badass in the back there. Yo! And then this one for season three, I assume. Nah, that looks badass. So February 23rd, only in theaters. I see. Okay. All right. Awesome. IMAX. All right. To any of you guys who are able to go see it in theaters, I hope you have a blast, bro. Promotion Reel 2024, okay.
Nah, 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 nah. Thank you. You foldable Anaplex, you're like killing it, bro. Man, this trailer was absolutely fantastic. It really hyped me up. To any of you guys who are going to get a chance to see it in theaters, I hope you have a fantastic time. It appears they're going to be doing the same thing they did this year by showing the last episode of season two and the first episode of season three. But now they're switching it up. Next year, they'll be showing the last episode of season three and the first episode of season four, combining both to form a movie. Plus, they're expanding and going to more countries. So 140 this time. Hopefully, Kenya's on that list. Probably not. You know, they never show anime movies in my country, but it is what it is. I don't mind settling down here to watch it with you guys when it does premiere uh spring 2024 on crunchyroll and all that kind of stuff my guess is probably april you know uh if they're going with the same formula they did with season three uh that dropped in april so my guess is okay it could be between march april and june so i'm i'm taking april as the bet you know so uh yeah regarding this particular season though i have spoken to a couple of my subscribers and discord members they have informed me that this uh, particular arc is about six chapters so this season might be a pretty short one, you know? Uh, I am curious to see how things are gonna play out with it, uh, but I have also been informed that uh, the next arc after this one is the big finale, and that one has like a lot of chapters. Um, and I heard rumors that maybe they're gonna turn it into a three-part movie. I don't know if that's true. Uh, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. But uh, regarding this arc, I am curious to see how things are gonna pick up, you know, because, uh, you know, throughout the season, uh, or the show primarily, um, I thought Tanjiro was the only one who had that mark, but uh, come to find out, Muichiro can do it too, Mitsuri can do it too, they both did it respectively in their fights with uh, Zohakuten and Kyoko, you know, so uh, hopefully we'll get to find out more information about that mark, and uh, I'm assuming, you know, since now we have uh, about four demons left, right? of course Muzan, we got Kokushibo, we got Doma and Akaza, there's no way they're gonna fight them without having, you know, mastered whatever the hell this mark power is, you know, there's no way they go into those fights with those respective demons, you know, not having mastered that mark power because i mean they had to use it to fight zohakuten and gyoko you know so will zenitsu get one will inosuke get one you know the rest of the hashiras as well i guess it remains to be seen because like there's no way you know it just doesn't make any sense <laughs> also muzan said he's not gonna make any more demons nezuko is the primary target now since he has conquered the sun he wants to absorb her and of course gain that power so, uh, yeah, I'm really excited to see how things are going to play out with them. And, uh, yeah, overall, how the story is going to go, man. I'm super, super excited. And, uh, yeah, let me know what your thoughts are down below in the comments section, guys. If you did enjoy my reaction, I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel. It really does help out a lot. Also, give it a thumbs up for the hype of Kimetsu no Yaiba. Peak is coming back in 2024. Cannot wait. Also, make sure to hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my future reaction videos, live streams, or walkthroughs. You can also feel free to follow me on all my social media, Twitter and Instagram. Links to that will be down below in the description of this particular video. You can also feel free to join our Discord. Link to that will be down below in the description of this particular video as well. You can also feel free to become a Patreon or a channel member by clicking the link down below in the description of this particular video to support your boy. And you always get a shout out in every single one of my videos. But until then, guys, have a lovely Sunday. Peace out. I'll see you guys next time.